Hi, another short video on fixing up, uh, improving up on the uh, 1992 Honda NSR 250RSE. Um, as you can see, I got it pretty well disassembled, body fairing, so forth, tank, etc. But uh, just kind of going through it, checking everything out. I highly recommend that for anybody who uh, gets one of these bikes and doesn't know much about its history. Um, one thing I found that was kind of spooky was that someone had put one of the front brake pads in backwards. So they actually were putting metal to the to the disc. So I found the re a backwards brake disc in there. So I just go through everything. I checked all the bolts too. I'm checking them and kind of looking at everything. But I just wanted to touch base on cleaning aluminum on these bikes because they can be pitted and really dirty and hard to clean. And I've been cleaning this thing for on and off for a couple of weeks now. But uh, some of the tools I used were these wire brushes. And you don't want to obviously use them on the more finished aluminum. But as you can see, this cast aluminum came out pretty nice. This was all pitted in black. If I can give you an example under here where it's a little dirtier. I didn't do down in here, as you can see, because you won't really see it. But it was kind of pitted and black and really grungy. So these wire brushes, and what I found is obviously WD-40 always is a great product. A degreaser, but you got to be careful because it can etch other aluminum. But uh, just a nice circular motion. But this is a steel brush, and I believe this other one was brass or uh, something. But uh, they work really nice. WD-40 gets in there, and also... I uh, used gum out, carburetor cleaner works wonders, but that came out pretty nice. And I pretty much tried to do everything you could see with some form of a cleaner or not. This was pretty uh, messed up, but I used steel wool on this. Uh, fine steel wool can work pretty well. Just try to stay in one direction, but you can uh, just do small areas and experiment, especially in hidden areas. And this was all rusted. I touched this up. I took it off. I just took it off the easy way. Um, the bolt here and these these uh, bolts here and then I just taped off all this other stuff and was able to spray this with a pretty close matching silver primed it and sprayed it and this was all chipped up and rusted so that came out really nice um, but just wanted to give you guys some uh, tips if it can help for cleaning bikes and especially these old uh, Japanese kind of classic sport bikes a lot of fun thanks for watching